me come over there and snatch you up off that couch. It's time for mail call. What's up guys? I just got home from work not long ago and I had a package in the mail. I was not expecting it. It's from my good buddies John and Lindia with Small Water Charters. If you haven't already, go check out their channel. I will drop a link. Uh, I was talking to them a few days ago and you know they have a seasoning down there that they really enjoy called uh, uh, let's see Everglade seasoning which we don't have that here in Louisiana at least not that I've ever seen and I mentioned that I'd like to try some so they told me that they would send me some well I wasn't expecting such a big box in the mail and uh, unless this is just slap full of seasoning I'm guessing they sent me some other goodies as well and I have no idea what's in here and I'm excited to uh, see what's in here and I've already uh, sent a text to John earlier <coughs> excuse me uh, making sure that it was cool to do this unboxing because you know sometimes you just don't need all that but he said that it was cool so I'm gonna share with all of you what uh, he and Lindy has sent me I don't know what it is but I can tell you I greatly appreciate it you know I've uh, made some pretty good friends through this whole YouTube thing you know people that I may never ever actually meet but I consider them a friend you know all the way up to Alaska you know all different parts of the, the country and a few of them even outside of the country so pretty cool thing you know YouTube is a friend maker I guess you could call it but anyway let's get into this thing all right no idea what's in here pretty heavy box things out of here one by one all right don't know what this is Looks like some little bottles or something oh they sent me bubble wrap I'll be entertained for the rest of the evening okay this is called <coughs> gator hammock Gator sauce and Gator hammock lethal gator. Huh. These are from I don't know if I'm saying this right, Felda, Florida, and they're some kind of hot sauce. Cool looking little bottles. Let's see what these things are working with. Yeah, that smells pretty doggone hot. <clears throat> That's the lethal gator. I'm going to take a, uh, a wussy taste here. It's got a pretty good flavor to it. You know, I didn't hardly have any on my finger. I, I can feel a little bit of warm, but it's not horrible. Now that's not to say that a uh, full size dose won't be horrible. That was the lethal gator. Let's see this gator sauce. Mmm, smells good. Both of these taste awesome. You know, I, I will eat hot things. I'm not a melt your tongue off fan of hot stuff but uh, I will be giving that stuff a, a proper try later on. Let's move on. Oh yeah here's the stuff. Let's 
see. These are actually pretty heavy bottles here. It's the Everglades seasoning, all-purpose seasoning, fish and chicken, and Everglades heat. That's kind of a little bit of everything bundled there, I think. <clears throat> All purpose. Hmm. Hmm. That smells pretty good. That smells pretty good. That was all purpose. This is fish and chicken. <clears throat> well, my nose isn't going to know what to do. All these things I'm sniffing in here today. Hmm. That smells really good. That smells very good. Hmm. I may be trying that on dinner tonight. <coughs> Everglades, Everglades heat. Hot and spicy seasoning. <coughs> hmm. That smells awesome too. This would probably be pretty good in some chili. Well, it says right there, great in chili. <laughs> or fajitas or tacos. Mm. So now I'm getting ideas for dinner. Still a lot to look at. So let me not get carried away with that. Let's move on here. Alright. Let's see what's in this box. It's a box in a box. All right, John shared some of his crack with me. Freeze-dried candies. That's a freeze-dried ice cream bar. I've had these before. Uh, a few years back, I went to Houston and went to the uh, NASA Space Center. I can't remember exactly what it's called. Johnson, I think. And, you know, they sold these in there called astronaut food. And they were ridiculously expensive, but I had to find out. So I bought one, and oh my God, it was good. That's probably not going to make it, you know, 10 minutes past the end of this video. Hmm. It's like freeze-dried mini marshmallows. It is. This is, I'm not sure. Saltwater taffy, caramel apple, awesome. I guarantee you I am going to go into a diabetic coma at some point tonight. And I will revive myself with some of this lethal gator. <clears throat> I can tell what that is right away. That is a freeze-dried... Easter peep. <laughs> Looks like a Christmas tree marshmallow. I guess that's what that is. Sweet tarts candy cane. Ooh. That's going to be good. Freeze dried Skittles. I saw John go absolutely nuts with these on a uh, Friday Night Live once. That's awesome. I cannot wait to dig into these. I am going to wait because I don't want to be rude. I can't offer you guys any. The freeze-dried candy corn. Now these come from Miss, as in Mrs., Miss Shells. Sweets and treats. Freeze dried fun. Made uh, down there in sunny Florida. 
I'm not sure if she has a website or anything. I'll look into that, and if she does, I will uh, come back and add a link to the description of this if there is one available. That's all for the candy. Let me just put it back in here to make a little room. Okay, we got more, more in the box. Man, they really hooked me up. Heavy bag here. Lightsey's Seafood Restaurant. Established 1977. Famous batter for anything that swims, crawls, or hops. Well, here in Louisiana, we got plenty of all of that. Much like you got down there in Florida. Made in-house for over 30 years. Huh. Well, I don't want to open that just yet, even though it does have a Ziploc deal up there, but that's pretty cool. I can't wait to try that. Something here. Y'all send me a beer. Looks like a beer bottle, old fashioned. Oh, okay. Some more seasoning. Lightsey Seafood Restaurant. Famous seasoning. Made in house over 30 years. I really like these old fashioned flip top style bottles. Oh man, that smells amazing. I don't know what's in it. Oh, I do know what's in it. Top secret ingredients. Man, that smells good. Mm. They say white folks don't use seasoning in their food. They don't know a southern folk. All right. Moving on. Buck knife. Got a note going along with it. Hey, Buck, give me this knife because it's special to me. Oh, wow. Miss Lindia, are you absolutely sure? I greatly appreciate this, but if you are regretting it in any way, I will send this back to you, ASAP. She said that this, this was her, let me make sure I read that right. This was her grandfather's knife, and she wanted me to have it. I'm a... Uh, I'm kind of blown away. I, I I don't know. That is a beautiful knife. Hmm. Wow. Well, I, I I really don't know what to say. I mean, I am very blown away by this. I uh. I greatly appreciate it and I will definitely treasure this but once again I'm gonna ask you are you absolutely sure because I, I I will send it back if you have any regrets at all but now look at that that is a slick looking little little pocket knife hmm. Wow Miss Lindy, I am very lost for words. Uh, I greatly appreciate that. That's that's something special. And I promise you, it will be cherished. Like the that's 
the original use and care instructions. Hmm. That's awesome. I, I, I'm, thank you. That's, <laughs> that's all I can say there. Hmm. Wow. All right, I'm, uh, I'm going to move on. That is amazing. This will be put away in a safe, special place where it could still be visible and appreciated and uh, looked upon at any given time. Outstanding. Okay. There's more in there. I thought that was the bottom. <clears throat> Florida seafood seasoning. Garlic butter, crab, and shrimp bowl. Hmm. Well, y'all hooked me up on some uh, some tasty stuff. Now, in the past, I've taken fish fry or even you know crab uh, bowl stuff, and uh, I've battered stuff like French fries and things like that before. And man, they always turn out really good. Okeechobee Brahmins. Did I say that right? I'm guessing this is a... Oh! Okeechobee High School. Now that's cool. That is pretty cool. Now I, I have a uh, valid reason for always singing the song that some of your videos have gotten stuck in my head and I can't get them out. Okay, E E C H O B E E, I love you. My brain shut off for a second. I forgot how to spell. I can spell it in my head when I'm singing along, but I don't have a singing voice, so I'm not going to put you all through that uh, torment. Right here in O K E E C H O B E E, I love you. It's an O K E E C H O B. -E. That's the bottom of the box there. Wow, guys, I, I'm i blown away. I, re, I really appreciate all this stuff. I cannot wait to dig in. I love good seasonings, and everything up here that you sent me smells amazing, and I can't wait to put it to work. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, guys, I owe y'all one now. This is uh, some pretty awesome stuff, and I really greatly appreciate it. And uh, if anybody out there that's following my channel doesn't already, which I kind of doubt it, but if you don't follow John and Lindy with Small Water Charters, get over there and check them out. They're constantly rolling out new uh, videos and doing all kinds of cool stuff, catching a lot of nice fish, stuff that I wish I could find here in Louisiana. But one of these days I'll get down there in Florida but I'm gonna go ahead and cut this short guys thank you so much I appreciate everything y'all sent me and this Lindia Wow let me know all right guys well I appreciate y'all watching and uh, John and Lindia thank you again and we'll catch y'all on the next video see y'all later <laughs>